Mr. Bruce, to do the presentation and the honors. So, table in your office so that as the when the come in and they're curious about it, you can also be an ambassador for those people to be a fire wide everybody else that comes to see. Let me start by saying that I, I deeply uh, appreciate the honor um, done to me and the SEC, of course. Um, for being part of the select group of um, Ghanaians to receive a piece of um, this Otum for Osei Tutu, the second uh, commemorative gold coin. I, I deem it as an honor and I'm humbled by that gesture as well. I mean, for me, it was a pleasure to be part of the launch uh, or the unveiling and let me quickly add that it was a grand ceremony i i was blown away by you know the organizers and i know you had a hand in it so well done for uh, a good a very very good uh, launch and i think it goes without saying that indeed uh, otum for uh, deserves to be celebrated in, in such a grand way um, because we cannot take peace uh, for granted. And um, indeed, without peace, you can't really even look at development. And you outline the fact that apart from um, what he has achieved in ensuring peace, he's also been contributing to the, um, the development of our nation, uh, Ghana. And I think your plan the roadmap to let every Ghanaian get a piece of this um, as much as is possible or to share in this legacy. I think it's very commendable. And I like to say that from the SEC, um, we, we can identify with the celebration. Um, and I like to draw an analogy or a link between what we do and peace because um, we all desire uh, peace. Some years ago, as I traveled uh, by road from the Western region to Accra, between, I think, Takwadi and um, Cape Coast, there were a number of towns, and I was taking note of the names of the towns. And there was one name that jumped out to me and it was Nakan. And the name was Ohia Ma'ajin. In other words, poverty can set you thinking <laughs> and it can create a lot of disturbance. And why I say we at the SEC can you know, connect with this mission of peace is that one of our um, drives, one of the things that drives us is to ensure that uh, we have wealth creation uh, because that is one of the ways in which people can have peace of mind um, and it's something that we wish to call upon all Ghanaians as they think about you know this legacy of peace also to think about the culture of savings and investment uh, because um, that is one of the sure way to ensure you have peace of mind and uh, again, if you look at some of the incidents that have happened, especially over the last few years when we had this financial sector cleanup, uh, there were pockets of agitations um, around. And it was all connected to uh, money or money's being locked up. So again, you know, the mandate of the SEC is to ensure that the players in the financial sector uh, stay on the right, on, on the straight and narrow. They do what is right uh, to ensure that the um, the monies that people through their sweat and toil uh, put aside in savings or investments is is well protected. Uh, 
And at the SEC, we want all the uh, market operators. Um, Access Bank, I know, is one of the listed uh, companies. So far, there are no issues we have with them. <laughs> and uh, it will be good for all our market operators to, to stay on the straight and narrow and to do just what is right. Because when you do the wrong thing, and it can create disturbance. I mean, we got a number of uh, letters or information from the national security indicating people getting into agitation and all of that, all because of, you know, money matters. So um, we want to continue with our mandate of ensuring that investors are protected and then the integrity of the uh, market is protected as well. Um, let me maybe touch on one thing that in recent times uh, is coming up, which is quite worrying. And that's the trend for people to look for quick fixes or quick ways of making money. And so you find what we call Ponzi schemes or pyramid schemes, where people say, uh, bring X amount, now double it. Um, every week you can get this amount. It's springing up all over the place. And it still surprises me that Ghanaians, you know, they fall to such schemes. You know, and we would like to send a strong warning to the perpetrators behind, you know, these activities that we have uh, forged a stronger alliance with the law enforcement agencies. And when you are caught, you know, scamming people, uh, the, the law will take its, its course. But may, may, may we also send this message to Ghanaians that let's be a bit more discerning and let's begin to ask questions when you are being promised something that is too good to be true. Ask questions. How are they able, you know, to uh, generate whatever returns to give you so much? Uh, because we all want peace of mind. Uh, personally, uh, I'm, 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 anywhere I go, you get people sending messages, asking questions. I, I quite remember I went to a social event, um, a birthday party, and I thought I was going to enjoy myself. And as I was going to the buffet table to serve myself, then this lady called me, you had SEC, my money. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we want that. <laughs> So, so, so let's do the right thing and, and, and let's ensure that um, also when it comes to uh, peace, we contribute to the, the, the peace uh, of the country and our own uh, our peace as individuals. But I think that uh, Toon Force legacy is definitely worth celebrating and uh, commendations to E on 3, you know, for this initiative, uh, Access Bank, for being the bank to support this. And, we are happy to uh, throw in our support uh, where it's possible to make sure that we entrench peace and development in um, our country. So uh, with that, I'd like to wish you well uh, in terms of your roadmap to um, engage the wider Ghanaian um, you know, uh, community. And thank you again for this honor, um, Danny. So, um, we will keep it securely. <laughs> and um, it will go on record that we were also part of, you know, the first batch of people to get a piece of this good quest. So thank you. Thank you. So thank, you. thank you. Thank you. Thank you.